Hello friends, today's Google celebrates Adelaide Hall's 122nd birthday. Adelaide Hall was an American-born UK-based jazz singer and entertainer, one of the world's first jazz singers and a significant entertainer of the Harlem Renaissance. In honor of UK Black History Month, Adelaide Hall Google Doodle showing along with short biography and life work. Let's know more about who was Adelaide Hall. Adelaide Hall, a jazz singer who is widely recognized for introducing scat singing during the Harlem Renaissance. The American-born, UK-based entertainer had a record-breaking career that spanned more than 70 years. Hall entered the Guinness Book of World Records in 2003 as the world's most enduring recording artist, having released material over eight consecutive decades. Hall was born on this day in 1901 in Brooklyn, New York. Adelaide's father taught her and her sister piano from a young age. After the tragic deaths of her father and sister, Adelaide had no choice but to support herself and her mother. She began her career singing in the chorus line for Shuffle Along, 1921, a popular all-black musical on Broadway that helped establish African-American show business. In 1925, Hall embarked on a European tour for Chocolate Kiddies playing in numerous cities including Hamburg, Geneva, Paris, and Vienna. The show was a resounding international success. Later, she returned to Manhattan and continued performing on Broadway's biggest stages. Her breakout moment came in 1927 when she hummed along to a show tune by Duke Ellington. The jazz star was entranced by her wordless yet emotive melody and asked her to record it with his band. A year later, that same song, Creole Love Call, landed on the American Billboard charts at number 19, and just like that, scat singing was born. It wasn't long before Adelaide Hall became a household name in both the US and Europe. She performed with major artists such as Art Tatum, Ethel Waters, Josephine Baker, Louis Armstrong. Soon after, Hall joined the cast for Lou Leslie's Blackbirds of 1928. The musical ran for more than 500 performances and attracted over a million viewers before moving to the Moulin Rouge in Paris. The audiences in Europe welcomed her with open arms, so much so that she decided to permanently move to the UK in 1938. Her international success only grew from there. Happy birthday, Adelaide Hall. Thanks for watching this video.